Morris Engines. I'm Steve Morris, and uh, this is the engine that we've been doing some tuning work and uh, some development work for uh, Wild Bill Divine over at uh, Bullseye Turbo. Those guys are just down the road from us, and uh, some buddies of ours. And uh, this is a 438 cubic inch small block Ford. Uh, this has uh, this actually has some uh, billet heads from uh, Dave Visner and uh, one of his intakes. That's not my intake. Uh, we do a, a little different style than that. But uh, this is a methanol motor, uh, 83 millimeter turbos from Bullseye. And uh, a couple things you'll notice here: uh, just twin injector per cylinder, of course. It's a, a normal deal that needs to happen. Uh, this is Holly EFI and uh, we've done the conversion there and uh, we've also uh, he was running the magneto and we've converted this to coil on plug and I've been working on the tune up with that um, we're going to be doing some more development work with this down the road and uh, we'll probably talk about that just a little bit later but right now we'll go out and uh, make a pull on this thing uh, we've been making pulls at the lower boost levels and um, uh, we've been sneaking up on tune-ups and uh, getting up there, and uh, we'll show you the uh, uh, at this tune-up level right now. So we'll go out and make a pull. All right, now well, let's take a look at some numbers here. You can see right here at uh, 5,500. Well, actually, we'll just start up in higher RPM. 6,000 RPM. That 5,500 number is actually no good. Uh, 6,000 RPM or 1841 and uh, 2,097 horsepower. 6,500, we're at 1,903 foot pounds of torque and 2,346 horsepower. Uh, we made a peak torque in 1944 at 6700 RPM and uh, 2468 horsepower. And uh, we can see right here, peak horsepower occurred at 25 or at 7100 RPM on this pull, uh, and that was 2544 horsepower. Right there you can see the horsepower. Now you can see the curve right up here. Um, we're probably just a, a a little bit short on uh, probably just a little bit short on camshaft as we've been running this throughout the day and it just it just kind of hovers right through there and uh, it doesn't really uh, isn't really doing much over 8,000 right now um, I think that's some things that will end up upgrading uh, here in the future but uh, we're gonna get this thing uh, put together and uh, uh, put it in Bill's car so he can make make this race next week and then uh, we'll take a look at uh, doing some upgrades and some changes later. But uh, I can show you some uh, boost numbers here. Uh, this was at. Now on the uh, this is what it's showing on the dyno, but it actually on the uh, on the Holly on the data logger and the Holly it actually made uh, 37 at about almost a pound more. I mean 37.1 pounds of boost right up here uh, pretty good uh, flat curve right through there that's why I make big torque uh, you know made 34 35 pounds of boost all the way down there at that 6500 number uh, EGTs let me scroll out here a little bit for you look real good uh, pretty darn even we've worked on a little bit of cylinder trims um, just to try to accommodate for just some inefficiencies here or there but not a big deal you know so we got everything uh, tailored up in this thing pretty good you know we're only looking at uh, uh, that one it's picking on that cylinder just a little bit and uh, and this cylinder just a little bit but uh, they're still within a hundred uh, degrees of each other and uh, I think ultimately we can make that even a little bit more and we'll we'll go in and uh, fine-tune that thing uh, just a little bit more but uh, anyway some pretty good horsepower numbers for a small block Ford on methanol 37 pounds and uh, uh, we're going to do some more upgrades and do some other stuff to this uh, after we get it in the car. So I'm Steve Morris, Steve Morris Engines, uh, here, here working on uh, Bullseye Power, small block forward for Wild Bill Divine.
Have a good day.